Hello everyone and welcome to another episode of Ray Games. Today we're going to go over a couple of little easter egg type tips and tricks that you can find in Stardew Valley. Some of these you might already know, some might have never come up for you. So hopefully this is something that you find useful. A big easter egg in this game is hats. So you'll see that you can put a hat on your little coral guy there. He's a pirate now. You can also put hats on your kids. I've got both of my kids matching in little cowboy hats. And then the other thing you can put hats on is your horse. So I've got the little tiger slime hat on him right now. And then I'm going to switch it out with my cat ears. So another trick is, let's say you want a different pair of boots, but you know, you obviously want the higher stats. You can take the high stat boots and the vanity pair of boots over to the sewing machine and you can put the stats on whatever boots you want. So in this case, I'm going to put the mermaid boots stats on these genie boots and you'll see that the uh, stats would transfer over. Just be careful because it will consume the high stat boots, so make sure that's something you are ready for. Do you find yourself jonesing for another pair of those Mayor's Lucky Purple Shorts? Well, you're in luck if you've already turned them in for your quest. All you have to do is go grab a staircase, and then you just put them in your pants slot. And bam, you have a trimmed lucky purple shorts that you can go and troll the mare with to your heart's content. So another tip is you do not have to give in to the evils of Joja Cola to get the auto petter. Uh, I actually have three. You'll see that um, the little, instead of hearts when you click them, they have a little happy face. The auto putter basically lets you, you put it in your barn and instead of losing hearts for forgetting to pet your animals, it just freezes it. You can go back and pet them to your heart's content whenever you feel like it without having to constantly keep up. Uh, the way you get them without joining Jojo Cola is in the uh, desert mines, the oasis. Uh, every once in a while you'll get them in a chest, so make sure you take advantage of those lucky days. After you've reached a certain level of friendship with Shane, you can start getting blue chickens. Uh, if you specifically want a certain color chicken, uh, there is a trick to that. Marnie, come on, get to work. So when you go to the purchase animals, you pick chicken. And you'll see at the top there, it says exactly what color the chicken is going to be. So if you don't like that, you can get out and try again. It pretty much cycles through white, blue, brown. Uh, so it's not like you have to keep trying that hard. So you'll see here it said blue chicken, and so I can pick exactly what color I want. So that's it for this video. Um, there are so many other little tips and tricks and hidden gems in this game, but to try and cover them would take me forever, and I'm sure I have not even found them all yet. So let me know what your favorite little Easter eggs in this game are, and I hope to see you in the next video.